Come here. Um, they, another thing that you got a lot of attention for, uh, look at this clip here, and I want to ask you about this. I respected your sincerity. I'd ask you to respect mine. Well, all due respect, in the most unparliamentary language, <laughs> you, Deputy Stag, <laughs> you. I apologise now for my use of De unparliamentary Deputy language. Doherty, that is most unparliamentary. Tell me, <laughs> you certainly won a lot of fans there now all over again. Did you just, did you just go mad and, and, like, did the red mist descend? Were you absolutely furious? Or... It, you, you see, the thing is, you turned around and apologised straight away, which made me think, OK, he, he knew what he was doing, he hadn't lost the rag. But clearly, to use that kind it of language... It wasn't planned. Yeah. The night before, there was a very vigorous debate going on, and Kathleen Lynch said to, about me, Count Carla, what drugs is he on? <laughs> and I said, I don't, I don't take drugs, I've never, never taken that, and I'm into sports, I, I get high in fresh air. And she said, well, he should stop taking it. <laughs> <laughs> so you can, you can take the bit of banter, yeah. but the debate was about the social welfare cuts in the budget. Yeah. And I was saying, if you're in opposition and you're saying it's totally unfair that vulnerable people are being affected, I agree with you. It is totally unfair. Um, I'm still going to vote for it because I think it would hurt more people. And that was my genuine view. It was a very emotional debate. Um, and Emmett Stagg threw in a broadside about me not being sincere. I, I was nearly crying in the debate because... The, the spirit of the 1916 rising and cherishing the children equally was brought up and people said, uh, and you, Deputy Gogarty, are you going to cherish our children equally? Shane McEntee looked me in the eye and I yeah. looked at him back. And I was nearly blubbering because I felt, you know, you have a point here, but I'm still going to vote for it because it's the lesser of two evils as I could see it. Okay. So it was very emotional. And then Emmett Stagg threw that in. You were much more brief about your whole thing than, you, than you're being now. <laughs> but it just went, you? eventually... I, it was a split second. I had yeah. about half a second, was yeah. I going to say it or not? And I was trying to think of something else. So I said in the most unparliamentary language possible yeah. to try and buy myself time, and now, it came out. Okay, but you...